Hello friends, today I will discuss about CT polarity and importance of CT star point connection for transmission line protection system. The symbol of current transformer has been shown in this above picture. Here P1 and P2 are the two terminal for primary side of the CT and S1 and S2 are the secondary terminal of the CT. When current flows from in the direction from P1 to P2 in the secondary side due to transformer action the current will flow from S2 to S1 terminal. Similarly when current flows in the direction from P2 to P1 in the primary side of the city the secondary current flows from S1 to S2 due to transformer action in the secondary side of the city. The CT should be connected with proper polarity in each substation. Here a transmission line is connected in between substation A and substation B. Uh, P1 is connected in the bus side of substation A. Similarly, P1 in the uh, substation B side are connected in the bus side of substation B and P2 should be connected in the line side or towards the line direction. Similarly, in the secondary side, uh, the secondary terminal uh, should be connected uh, with proper polarity in the relay connection. In uh, MICOM uh, P442 uh, for red, yellow and blue phase terminal has been shown as C2 to C3 uh, for red phase and for yellow C5 and C6 and for blue phase it is C8 to C9. Therefore in secondary side S1 terminal for red phase shall be connected to C2 terminal for C2 to C C3 coil and similarly for yellow phase S1 terminal for in the secondary side for yellow phase shall be connected to the C5 terminal for coil C5 C6 similarly for blue phase S1 terminal shall be connected for to the C8 terminal in the relay end for coil CH C9. C3, C6 and C9 shall be sorted and neutral shall be connected uh, to the S2 terminal for red, yellow and blue phase as shown in this diagram. That is in primary side P1 shall be connected in the uh, bus side of the substation. Similarly in the secondary side S1 terminal shall be connected with proper polarity uh, of the relay. This is the uh, general concept for connection of the proper polarity uh, for CT and here CT star point uh, are connected uh, towards the line that is towards the protected, protected object. Here protective object is line. Now when current flows uh, in the primary side of the rate phase in the direction from P1 to P2 current will flow from the uh, secondary side uh, with direction from S2 to S1 similarly uh, in the relay it will be from C2 to C3 it is the forward direction uh, for the relay that is uh, for proper polarity P1 shall be connected in the bus side and similarly S1 shall be connected in the uh, C2 terminal for MICOM P442 um, relay. Similarly for uh, reverse polarity we can change uh, polarity in the primary either in the primary side or in the secondary side. In primary side that is P2 shall be, should, should be connected in the bus side and P1 shall be connected in the line side for reverse polarity. Similarly by Mm, keeping uh, unchanged in the uh, P1 uh, unchanged in the primary side of the CT that is P1 shall be connected in the bus side and P2 shall be connected in the secondary side we can rev uh, we can uh, interchange the uh, S1 and S2 terminal that is S2 shall be connected in the C2 terminal and S1 shall be connected in the C3 terminal that is how the polarity can be reversed uh, in case of CT Whenever a fault occur in a point F in between section A and B, um, section A and B, 
the current will be flow from P1 to P2. Similarly, in the secondary side, uh, the relay will see the forward direction fault and it will send a trip signal to the circuit breaker associated with the substation A to clear the fault. Now, in this case, uh, CT polarity is reversed and CT star point is uh, not towards line. Here, uh, P1 and P2 remain an unchanged and S1 and S2 terminal are connected. All the S2 terminal are connected in the uh, C2, C5 and C8 of red, yellow, blue phase coil of the MICOM P442. And C3, C6 and C9 uh, coil are sorted and uh, connected to the S1 terminal of each phase uh, of secondary side of the CT as shown in this diagram. Here the CT star point is not towards the line, instead it is the bus side. Now we will check what will happen in the forward direction of the fault. Now fault occur in the same point at uh, point F in between section AB. Uh, the, uh, since the current is again from P1 to P2, uh, but uh, in the secondary side uh, current will be from S2 to S1. and but in case of uh, relay coil in red phase, it will be from uh, C3 to C2 um, as shown in this direction, in this figure. That is, in relay coil, it sees uh, fault in the reverse direction. That is why it will not pick up or if uh, zone 4 setting is um, set uh, such that uh, it comes within zone 4 setting it will pick up in zone 4 and it will trip after zone 4 time instead of zone 1 time. Now again we consider in between substation A and B in from substation A there exists an another line to the substation C as shown in this diagram. Uh, now CT polarity is reversed uh, connected uh, from line substation A and substation B for substation A and as shown in this diagram. Now fault occur in uh, at a point F in between section A to C. For A to C uh, fault uh, the relay shall trip at substation A and and at substation C and for section AC only. But uh, since Mm, fault occur at point F, the current will be from P2 to P1 for uh, relay at substation A and for section AB tr of transmission line. That is, the current direction will be from S1 to S2. Similarly, current direction at the relay end that will be from C2 to C3, that is, it will see a forward direction of the fault. Now consider a transmission line, the transmission line length for section AB is 100 km and section AC is 100 km and fault occur in between, uh, exactly between section A to C that is at 50 km. For substation A to B at substation A end for zone 1 times uh, zone 1 setting shall be 80 percent of the line length that is 80 km. Uh, now, um, for reverse fault, that is actually uh, MICOM P442, it is uh, set as a reverse fault. Now, since fault occur at point F, it is uh, at 50 km of the line length in between section A to C. Now, since zone 1 setting is set at uh, P442 as 80 km, due to reverse polarity for the CT, at substation A for line of A to B, the point fault point uh, that point for fault at a point F, and the MICOM P442 relay will pick up at zone one time and it will trip the um, breaker at substation A for transmission line in between section A to B, and therefore it will unnecessary outage uh, of the a to B section that is the healthy section of the transmission line. 
that is why uh, the ct polarity should be properly connected in the primary and secondary side of the uh, relay mm. and ct star point should be uh, always should be the protected object that is in case of transmission line the star point shall be towards the line now we can uh, understand uh, the importance of the ct polarity uh, for and also the ct star point for transmission line protection if you like my videos then please do subscribe my channel and also press the bell button for notification of videos to be to be uploaded in future and also please do comment uh, whether you like my videos or not uh, and your feedback is necessary for improvement of videos to be uploaded in future thank you